Living in a freezing environment, you know, people have great vulnerability. Climbing in the Himalaya for more than three decades, I think what I've learned is that the people that you're climbing with are expecting you to be an aura above them and a net below them. You know, any number of different things can, can create that fatal cascade. It's just all about the details of prepping the gear, constantly thinking about what type of equipment you're going to need to get through that terrain. It's really difficult to single out any single piece of equipment because everything works together like a system. Any little deficiency in a piece of equipment, whether that's an ice axe, whether that's the rope, can lead to the failure of the entire system. From something as simple as having you know, goggles that fog up, maybe you take a small fall and sprain your ankle. You have to take a glove off to tie your shoes a little tighter to support your ankle a bit better. Maybe a glove blows away. All of a sudden, you have a hand that could be frostbitten to the point of complete non-utility within two, three minutes. It might kill you. It's just all about